Jesus. How much more in your body that is the temple of the Holy Spirit? You have defiled the temple of the Holy Spirit with unclean things. You have defiled the temple of the Holy Spirit with idol. Anyone that destroyed the temple of the Holy Spirit, God will destroy him. I pray he will not portion in the mighty name of Jesus. sisters. My name is Jean Leticia Ngenkan. I've been a believer for long. I live in London. I've been a believer for long, for about 18 to 19 years today. But I've been working in church, working in church, doing, focusing in God's stuff. But it's only the last year that uh, I discovered the truth, the real truth, and I begin to follow and God come to link me in this uh, uh, group of uh, virtuous women in Christ. Three days ago. So as they started prayer, I joined them. As I joined them in, in, in the prayer, the fasting, just the second day. God will show me this. I got a dream. I saw myself for a place. In that place, I saw a lady who were in my former church with her, in the Christian Church of God. We were in the same department. I saw her. She was in a deep hole that called her fire. The fire was burning that lady. She was crying. She was screaming. <laughs> As well with her, because the scripture, the, the, the voice she was using, the way she was crying, no human strength can move that type of such uh, such scream. She was screaming, she was crying for a way that normal strength could not carry that scream. And inside the screen, she said, "Go and tell the virtuous women in Christ to hold what they are doing strong, to hold their vision strong." I don't want them to come where I am. In this place that I am, there is too much problem. There is too much trouble. There is too much pain. Tell them not to come to this place. Tell them that I don't want them to come to this place. Tell them to own what they are doing, to hold their vision very strong. As, as she was saying like that, crying, me too, I was crying with her. And I said to her, don't worry. I will go and tell them for you. I will let them know. I will tell them what, what you say. I will tell Sister Claire for you. Don't worry. I will go and tell them. When I was saying that, I thought saying that to her would bring down the, 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 the pain she was feeling. But she was still screaming and repeating, go tell the virtuous women in Christ that they should hold their vision strong. They should hold what they are doing strong. Tell them, I don't want them to come to this place. They shouldn't come to this place I am. There is too much pain, too much trouble in this place. I don't want them to come. Go and tell them. Immediately as she said that, I was repeating to her that I want to tell the virtuous women, crying with her, screaming to her. 
my daughter just come and touch me. Then when I turned to look at my daughter, I saw that I was sleeping. And even when I get up, even not talking, it's like I'm still feeling, feeling the type of the, 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 the cry that was coming out of that woman tummy, the way she was screaming. I'm still feeling what she was feeling. I'm still like you see the type of hole she was there, the type of it, the type of fire she was inside. I could not sleep again. I was only thinking about it. And what touched me much was that the lady in case is alive. She's not even sick. But I don't know why I could see her in such place. And she is a deacon in their, in, their, in their church now. So I don't know why she could be in such place screaming that way. I don't really know. It's only, I don't really know what I can say about it. I am telling the virtuous women now, please, my sisters, my mothers, my children, please hold it strong. If God could show one of you this, it means that you are in the right track. Hold it strong. Even if you were giving half of you, give your food now. Give yourself, put yourself for the God that put us in it. He cannot lie to us. He cannot lie to us. Hold it strong. And try to for the other people to come out of the bondage and know what you know. Because I'm just I'm just a baby in this group. But God, it please God to show me this thing. Maybe it's for me to know that what I'm doing is not wrong. Maybe it's for me to tell other people. I want to tell you that anytime you want to connect, don't think that you are wasting your time. God know about this group. It's a group ordained by God. If someone could say, tell the virtuous women in Christ, it means that we are in the rich and we are doing the right thing. Amen. We are doing the right thing. Let's remain Fortify and encourage. We shouldn't let anything to draw us back. Please. We shouldn't let anything. The type of fire I saw, the type of screaming, I cannot have strength to, to scream that one. As for me, I will not let anything take me there because I will not scream that one. I can't face that pain. Please, you two don't, you will not face that pain in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name, we will click together. Oh, no.